Hi, my name is Cindy and welcome to the Home Automation X channel. Thank you for watching. What do you guys think of our new location? We will be giving you a little tour of the place as we build a simple smart home with these Tekken plugs, switches, and outlets. They send us all these devices. Now, if you want to see more smart home videos like this one, please subscribe and click on that bell icon so you get notified. Also, please use our Amazon links if you shop on Amazon. These links are in every one of our videos and they really do help us out. Finally, if you want to see our videos weeks before anyone else, see our Patreon link down below for all the details. I want to start by mentioning that our videos don't get a lot of comments when released. We want this video to get 500 comments, so tell us if you want to see more smart home videos. Click pause and we will wait and then tell us what you want to see more of in the smart home videos in the comment section. We will show you some things you probably didn't know you would be able to do with your smart home. So watch this video to the end and learn some new ideas. And I will start with this small wall outlet and it's smart as well. This one has a USB port and it can be controlled separately. I wish all outlets came with a USB charging port, don't you? It's perfect for charging your phones or tablets. Also, a place like the kitchen would look a lot cleaner if it didn't have smart plugs in all of your outlets. It's simple to install and you simply match the wires to their corresponding colors. The black is the live wire, the white is neutral, and the green goes into the ground. Here is the outlet we are going to install. Now I definitely would receive comments if I didn't tell you to turn the power off before you install it. All right, now we're in the basement and I wanna ensure that you definitely flip the breaker before you start. All right, so as you can see, we have installed now the outlet and we've matched the wires. So the white is going to the white, the black is to the black and the green is to the green. And I'm just gonna push it in here, tidy it up. And then I'm going to put this in and grab my handy tool here. Da -da. and voila match it up and it would help if it wasn't in reverse <laughs> oh, that's so funny I never pushed it back okay all right we got you covered and we've got this covered too you're just going to make sure that you lock it in and you are good to go and do the same for the bottom well we're back in the basement we've reinstalled it and now we're just going to turn the power back on all right, so we are gonna use the Smart Life app for everything we use today. And what you're gonna to wanna to do is make sure that there is a flashing light that will show that it's ready to pair. And if it isn't flashing, all you gotta do is hold down this button for seven seconds and you're good to go. I will wait until it starts to flash and then go into the app and select Auto Scan. It will show up and I will follow the screens to enter my Wi-Fi network information. We're pretty much done. I'm gonna name the top outlet Coffee Maker, and the bottom one I have no idea. Maybe Toaster. Leave a comment and let me know what you have plugged into your kitchen. Now I can control them separately in the app and also turn the USB on or off. And I can easily create the schedules so I can have that coffee ready for me in the morning on any day of the week. Now I'm not gonna bore you and go through the install of every product here, because I already did that in the app. They are the same procedure. If the LED isn't flashing, hold down the power button for about seven seconds. I will remind you to stay to the end as I'm gonna show you a really cool tip to really make your home smart. Now, check these guys out. They look like a two-pack of Wi-Fi switches, but they're not. They're actually a three-way smart switch, and they're commonly used at the top and bottom of your stairs and must be installed together. You can't just replace the one switch. Otherwise, if you turn the light on and go upstairs, you'll have to run back downstairs to turn it off, which is not very practical. I have them installed by the foyer light, and we'll show them in action in just a moment. Let me know if you have Tekken products in your home. I found their ratings and reviews on Amazon to be very good. 
This one here is a single pull switch and they sent us a bunch of them. We already installed them throughout the entire house and they are labeled at the back, which is green for the ground, white for neutral, black for the line and red for the load. And the load is being the black wire going to our lights. They are all set up and as soon as we show you all the action in the house, you will understand. So they sent us this dimmer switch, which we use to control our ceiling light for when watching TV. And it was a great addition. Just a note, we put the links down below to get the specs on all of these devices. And if you notice here, we can actually control it by swinging our hand up and down to control it. They also sent us all of these smart plugs. And this four pack right here contains a USB port on each plug. And I'll show you that right now as you can see and this is actually um, because of the plug's narrow size you can actually fit two of them and stack them like so and that's pretty neat these are great for things like a floor lamp a fan or even a heater and we're surrounded by fans here <laughs> we used them in the last house for our cabinet lights and this four pack of round lights is a little different again now this four pack of round smart plugs are a little cheaper, but they do do the same thing. The main difference is they don't have a USB port and you can't put them above each other in an outlet because they are just too round. We have brought the smart plug outside. Check it out. It's the round one and we've actually plugged it in to control the fan. So by ordering a simple command to Alexa, we can turn on that fan. Now they sent us two boxes of them, which is more than we need. So if you have been still watching up until this point, then you are entitled to win this giveaway. Leave a comment saying you like the four pack of round smart plugs, and I will reply to one of the comments below. This particular giveaway will be available to anyone in the US and Canada. Finally, before I show you all of this in action, I have one more to show you. It's this outdoor smart plug with three individual sockets. And it's great to control outdoor lights in your garden, on your porch, or around your house. It is weatherproof and you can set all sorts of timers. So I actually have two Amazon Echoes in this room and it would be a nightmare to remember what all of these switches are called. But let me show you just how easy it is to operate. At the flick of a button, turn on lights. Okay. Now, if you thought that was cool, I can do that across the board in any of the rooms. And now I'm gonna show you just how easy it is to turn them off as well. Turn off lights. Okay. This was accomplished by adding the echoes into the same group with all these lights. So if this echo hears my command, it will know I'm referring to these lights. If the echo in the family room hears my voice, it will control only the devices in the family room group. One trick I had to do was first go into the Alexa app and under the devices, change the switch setting to a light. Having your Echo control the switches makes sense because we have these five switches here and another five over there. Now it's impossible to remember what they're all for. I can easily tell my Echo to turn on the chandelier, the dining room lights, or even the cabinet lights. The only thing I would recommend is to change the color. They have the green as being LED off and it turns red when it's on. To me, it should be the other way around. If you watched all the way to the end, then leave a comment saying smart home and you will have another entry into our giveaway. Having switches and plugs are the easiest way to start your smart home and we really like the Tekken brand of products. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you found it useful, please share it with someone. You can see our latest and greatest right here on the side. Subscribe to see more videos, follow us on Facebook and Instagram, and don't forget to check out our website at homeautomationx.com. Thank you for watching.